What's up, what's up, mamas? I just got finished with a workout. Currently sitting in the sauna to end my time uh, of self-care. But I had something I wanted to uh, say that I hope will inspire you all. So I know for me, you know, it took quite a bit of time for me to get back into my routine of working out. You know, for some, it could take uh, right after recovery, uh, after having their child. Um, for some, it could take months. And for others, it could take years, right? But one thing that I recognize, at least for me, my son, he's two now. And so going to the gym was really out of the question. And I had him during the pandemic. So it's been out of the question for me uh, since that time, right? And so with that being said though, one thing I recognize is at a point in time, I was making an excuse. I was waking up, uh, trying to work out while he was asleep. And you know, if he happened to wake up, then that was the end of that workout. And then it got to a point where he started waking up early multiple days of the week and so I just stopped working out first it was a day then it became a week then it became almost a whole month right and of course I was loving getting more sleep during that time but then it clicked you're out of your routine okay you need to get back into your mojo and so I just wanted to encourage you mamas and anyone really but really want to focus on the mamas because we are servicing so many other people, whether it be our husband, our kids, uh, our extended families, we're working, we're preparing, we're nurturing, we're doing so many things. And not to say that fathers are not, but moms have a lot that we're carrying. We have two full-time jobs. Uh, <laughs> you know, the kids alone is a full-time job, as well as any other endeavors that we have taking place. So I say that to say, start off small. I remember hearing um, in a audio book that I was listening to that it takes five seconds. I think it was Mel Robbins. It takes five seconds, okay? Set your mind to it and just do it, right? If you're the type that like to set tasks for yourself and you make sure that you accomplish all your tasks by the end of the day, then do that. But again, set a small goal three days a week. You know, if you're like me and you can't get to the gym, there's so many online workouts that are free, right? YouTube has so many, and I've been partaking in a lot of different ones and found some that are my favorite, okay? But I say all that to say, I used to work out for wanting to look good and get snatched and everything else for me, for my appearance to be appealing to others, right? But now I work out for health purposes because in order for us to be the best version for all of those others that we service, we have to be healthy ourselves, okay? And that takes taking time out for you, getting you a quick workout in. That way it makes sure that you are remaining healthy, okay? So with that being said, set, your, set a... Uh, a goal of three days a week. If you're like me, my son is up and he's right there doing the workouts with me, having him a good time. And at times he don't feel like doing the workouts and he tell me, and he playing with his toys. And I'm totally okay with that. But that's no longer my excuse of why I'm not working out. Whether he's joining me or whether he's asleep, I gotta get it in for me, okay? So I challenge you, get started, okay? Then it's gonna become a routine. And then it's just gonna be a part of your life. Okay, the best wealth is gonna be your health. Okay, so another thing that I saw there, I'm gonna say, it's you versus you. So what's stopping you? You, get to it. Let's go mamas, I'm rooting for you. I'm here doing it too. Let's keep going and be the best version of us. See ya.